Next, we have the ion thruster. The first ion thruster was used in space in 1998 on the space probe Deep Space One. These take a neutral gas and ionize it, that is, charge it electrically by removing its electrons. Electrons have a negative charge, so when they are removed, the cloud of gas becomes positively charged. When the thruster needs to begin movement, it re-injects the electrons previously taken, and the resulting ion movement and gas expansion produces thrust. More advanced ion thrusters are in development in the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, as they attempt to develop the first ever plane with no moving parts. The plane looks to use electricity to create a constant ionic wind running through electrode-lined wings. 